Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the United States Army Garrison Fort Huachuca Change of Command Ceremony. This morning, Colonel Chad O. Rambo will relinquish command of the United States Army Garrison Fort Huachuca, Arizona, to Colonel Jared P. Moreland. The reviewing officer for today's ceremony is Major General Laura A. Potter, Commanding General, United States Army Intelligence Center of Excellence and Fort Huachuca. Due to COVID-19 preventative measures, the colors will not physically be passed today in today's ceremony. By authority of Army Regulation 600-20, paragraph 2-3, the undersigned assumes command of the United States Army Garrison, Fort Huachuca, Arizona, effective 17 June 2020. Signed, Colonel Jared P. Moreland, Colonel, Military Intelligence, Commanding. During Colonel Rambo's tenure, the garrison supported the Army's FY 15 through 19, 300% increase in unmanned system operator and maintainer training. He used innovative ideas to improve our aging Libby Army airfield infrastructure while ensuring good fiscal stewardship of the government's money. Under his leadership, he enabled installation range control operations to develop and execute live fire crew serve ranges for the 40th Expeditionary Signal Battalion. And that was only the second time in over the last 20 years we've conducted such a range. Lastly, after receiving notification of a base support installation activation for the President's directed Southwest Border Mission, Fort Huachuca readied the installation for the housing and support for a brigade size element in under a week. Fort Huachuca continues to be an integral part of this mission through logistical support, operational headquarters spacing, and maintaining the readiness to house and support larger elements of deploying forces as needed to support this national security mission. Lastly, and probably on the forefront of many minds uh, here, is his calm and extraordinary leadership as the Army and this installation grappled with the challenges of a global pandemic. I could not have asked for a better leader at my side to help us through this crisis. These are but a few of Colonel Rambo's extraordinary successes while in garrison command. And if I were to tout all of them, I'm sure we would be here for several hours. If I leave you with one final overarching accomplishment, it is that Colonel Rambo and his wife, Janie, deeply cared about the welfare of the base and the community. I wanna thank you both for the extraordinary leadership and the climate that you set for this base and its families. As Colonel Rambo completes his time in command, Colonel Jared Moreland begins his tour. Colonel Moreland, a career military intelligence officer, offers a wealth of experience and is a combat tested leader. He has over six years of experience right here on Fort Huachuca, including as a student, as a company commander, and most recently as an Army capabilities manager. I have the utmost confidence in Colonel Moreland to lead the garrison in an extraordinary manner. So when I came on as the commander of the garrison, I asked the garrison folks to operate along three guiding principles, those being teamwork, expertise, and contribution. I believe that after basic dignity and respect for all people, the Army values, that the next step to success is teamwork. And the garrison has been a great team. Not only did they strengthen their existing teams they already had in place, but they continuously looked for new ways to build new teams, both across post and in the community. So garrison, thank you very much for being great teammates. Expertise. I also believe that we owe it to ourselves and those we serve to be the best we can possibly be at what we do. So I ask the garrison to continuously look for new ways to improve their skills. And they did this in a tremendous way. They truly are a team of experts. As the garrison commander, you know, the functions of the garrison are so varied that no single individual can be an expert in all of it. So I relied heavily on my team of experts to provide me with the information I needed to make good decisions. And they did this in an outstanding manner. So thank you for being experts at what you do. Contribution. So after you're effectively operating as a team and you're an expert at what you do, then you can truly start to contribute. And for the garrison, that contribution boils down simply to making the lives of those we serve better. And the garrison did this. Every day, someone in the garrison made a positive difference in someone else's life. 
So Garrison, thank you for your contribution. Jared, I hope you and your family enjoy Fort Huachuca as much as we have. Best of luck, support and defend, always out front, Army Strong. Fort Huachuca has a long and proud history, and we are honored to be a part of that history and all that is still yet to come. We have been fortunate to live here on Fort Huachuca for the past year, and we've seen the incredibly strong bonds between Fort Huachuca, Sierra Vista, Huachuca City, and Cochise County. The partnerships that exist between Fort Huachuca and our neighbors outside the gates are critical and enable us to conduct world-class military intelligence training, electronic, te electronic testing, and operate the world's largest unmanned aircraft systems training site. We look forward to continuing and even expanding these partnerships across our communities. And I know that through communication and teamwork, we can continue to grow together here in Cochise County. Thank you.